Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in to Keep Cooking with Pam Davidson. And today we're going to make some jalapeno poppers. So thank you for liking and sharing my page. And we are going to get started here. First thing I'm going to do, we grew these jalapenos in our garden. And I'm going to take and put on a pair of these gloves. I know all y'all got gloves around your house due to the pandemic, but... I'm going to take a pair of these gloves. Anytime I mess with jalapenos, I do these because you touch these things and they're hot. And then you touch your lip or something. It's very hot. So we're going to take and we're going to cut them long ways. Each one. And then I got a little thing here. This is a vegetable peeler. And I just use that to help me scoop the seeds out. So I just reach down there and I'm going to scoop these seeds out and put them in this little thing right here and I just leave the stem on because they can pick them up like that and eat them Ooh, and I can already I can already smell these things are hot so I'm just going to scoop a few out here and then we're going to stuff them I'm going to make up a mixture and I'm going to show you all in a minute what that mixture is going to be but the hotness is from <coughs> from the seeds and whoo it goes right down my throat all right i'm gonna peel some more of these hang on all right i'm continuing to cut them here just cut them long ways like that and you just want to dig the seeds out of them so i just take this little potato peeler and i'm just digging the seeds out and i'm gonna put them all right here on a baking tray and we're going to stuff them all. And that's all there is to this part. Let me finish these and I'll come right back. All right, see, I got them all ready to stuff. And I go ahead and I lay them right on a little baking pan. All right, now I'm going to get rid of this stuff here because it smells like jalapenos. Set this stuff over here for a minute. All right, now we're going to take, now this is a kind of a small batch, so I'm going to take about a half a block of cream cheese. So I'm going to put that in my mixing bowl right there. And I'm going to take, this is about a half a jar. These are real bacon bits. So I'm going to take, Take some of them, just ever how many you want to taste. And then I'm going to take some uh, cheddar cheese. This is shredded cheddar cheese. I'll mix that up. So we're going to mix this up with right in here like this. Probably be easier with my hands. This is just the two, the, the cream cheese, the cheddar cheese, and the bacon bits. So we'll make a little mixture here, and then we're going to take this, and that's what we're going to stuff in each one of these jalapenos. All right, looks like we need a little bit more of this uh, shredded cheese. And I think I'm just going to go ahead and use the rest of them bacon bits. Wasn't many more left in that jar. All right. And we're going to cook these in the oven. I'm probably going to cook them. I don't know uh, what the temperature is. Probably going to be 350, 400. I'll let y'all know when I get ready to put them in what I cook them on. All right, so we got that mixed up. So now you just wanna grab a bunch of it and stuff it down in the jalapeno like that. Stuff it in there like that and then lay it back on the tray. Pick up the next one. This goes pretty quick, just stuff them like that. 
and we're going to bake these in the oven and uh i'm not sure how long we're going to bake them i have to check and see on that and let y'all know well, i'm gonna go ahead and stuff all these then i'll come right back right i got them all stuffed ready to go in the oven and I'm going to make these in the toaster oven because it's just one small tray. And I'm going to start them at 400 for about 20 minutes. And I'll let you know how that does. Okay, I just took them out of the toaster oven. I cooked them 400 degrees for about 20 minutes. And I'm going to put them up there so you can see them. All right. And that's all there is to jalapeno poppers. Y'all, please share my videos and um, be sure to follow my page if you're not already following it. Go, go to my page and click on the blue follow button. Thanks a lot. Talk to y'all soon. Bye.